interesting segment we have right now because Payless is launching their Go Green campaign. And to talk about Mission Zero bags are our good friends from Payless right now, Ms. Karina Pegarito. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Thanks nice for welcoming. And of course, the very beautiful and very talented and the <laughs> recently <laughs> crowned KUM Care Force <laughs> Honors recipient, Miss Peggy Denny. Peggy, hop it in. Thank you for joining Happy us. Happy day. Thank you so and much. And Happy New Year to you both. You too. Happy About New Year to you days, too. Uh, I know. Later. Okay, so, right. so like obviously I've got the calendar all wrong, but let's talk about the Payless uh, Mission Zero bags. Uh, what's it all about? You know, it's generating a really positive buzz in the community. For people that they haven't heard about it, what's going on? Um, what we're doing is Payless has launched their Go Green campaign in 1998. So what we're doing is we're revamping it. And so this year we added two um, important facets to our Mission Zero uh, bag campaign and also our recycling. So what we're doing is um, one facet of it is we're going to have recycling bins at all seven of our Payless locations. And we're partnering up with the iRecycle program with that. And so we're going to be um, doing plastics and aluminum and we'll be donating the aluminums to the iRecycle program. To well, I was going to say, Peggy, of course, you know, yes. your, your name and, and your passion is synonymous with recycling and everything like that. So what does it mean to partner uh, with a company the size and you know as motivated as Payless to help you achieve these ends? Well it's awesome. We have no <laughs> idea what to expect from the community as far as the recycling efforts go but we have uh, partnered a specific school with each with mm -hmm. each specific store and uh, we have points of contact at, at each of the schools and then we will see how that goes yes. because they're going to recycle plastic and aluminum and uh, I think they will have to, Payless will have to take care of the plastic, but the schools <laughs> will take care of the aluminum. And All they right, will come pick it up, and hopefully it will help them fill their bins even faster. Yes, exactly. Yes. Well, obviously, the both of you are wearing these beautiful Mission Zero bag yes. shirts. Yes. And uh, <laughs> like I said, I mean, you know, we've um, done a little bit of press about it. You know, mm -hmm. um, obviously, the intent is to eliminate uh, the use of excessive bags, and, yes. and you are passing out uh, eco conscious. Bags. Yes. yes, and That's so it. on January 25th, actually this Wednesday, we're going to be launching our Mission Zero Bags campaign. And what that basically entails is um, Payless is trying to eliminate, slowly eliminate the use of plastic distri bag distribution from our stores. Mm -hmm. So where we have our designated Mission Zero Bag days where on the third and fourth Wednesday of every month till July, and then starting August every Wednesday, we will not be distributing any plastic bags and even brown bags. So what we're trying to do is encourage the community to bring their reusable bags. Mm -hmm. And if, say, you come to our stores and you don't have a reusable bag, what we do is um, you can purchase a reusable bag for 75 cents on Mission Zero Bag Days, or you can either, um, we, we call it a fee, it's a five cent donation actually mm -hmm. that goes towards, um, that. When you, when you purchase a brown bag, it's a five cent fee that goes towards the community foundation and that money goes towards a mini grant program where we donate to schools and nonprofit organizations. So 75 cents for a bag that you're gonna reuse time and time yes, and time again. Yes, exactly. And five and, cents. And all the money that's ultimately generated goes towards helping the island. And yes, exactly. So why would people not wanna do this? Exa that's my question, <laughs> you know, but that's where we're encouraging everybody to be able to jump on this program and we know it's, uh, it, you know, I have it to go to a grocery store or any retailer and then expect to get a plastic bag. So it's just something that we just have to change our habits to go towards, you know, to being more green and so that's what Payless is encouraging everybody to come on board with us on that. Okay, so Peggy, how do you feel about, once again, you know, you've talked about, you know, the, um, the fruitfulness of your partnership and everything like that. What does it mean to you as someone whose life's work uh, is dedicated to, you know, cleaning up the island and make sure that, you know, Guam doesn't produce all of this excessive waste and everything and, you know, we hurt the future generations with that? Yes, well, I'm thrilled to be working with <laughs> Payless and I'm very, very proud of them for the efforts that, the, that they are putting forth. Um, they know very well that I hope that this program will accelerate <laughs> a lot faster <laughs> than it's initially yes. planned for. And we'll just have to see what the community response is. But hopefully it's going to be very, very positive. Mm -hmm. And people will, if they don't already understand, they will learn about the impacts of plastics on the marine environment. Mm -hmm. And that's, that's what this is all about. Because any time, any type of plastic is not either disposed of or recycled on an island, it ends up in the ocean. Mm -hmm. And that's, it's just, the idea is just to help people understand that, to raise awareness. And, and then every single one of us do our part 
you know, to reduce waste on Guam. All right. Well, ladies, thank you so much. And Karina, let me say, I know all of you are very, very motivated and very yes. high speed. Good luck keeping up with Peggy because I know. <laughs> she, she <laughs> is very been. motivated. Yes, You'll exactly. enjoy the experience as, as we do working with her. So thank you very much, ladies. Thank, thank you. you. All right. And stay tuned because there is much more show. KU News Extra continues right here right after this.